trophy smell. It's as good as mine. You know, I may as well just take it home now since we all know I'll be winning it tomorrow. If you win tomorrow's race, it's all yours. But until then, uh, it goes into the trophy case. Just let me hold it a little longer. <laughs> Get okay, everyone. Keep the paws off until tomorrow, okay? Okay. Awesome trophy, isn't it? Hey, where'd everybody go? I better get back to Strut's clubhouse to work on my car. Trophy. 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 That's it. I'm going to bed. You okay, Clutch? I'm fine. Well, good night. All I can think about is that beautiful trophy. I have to get to the gas station to see it one more time. Seatbelts on. GPS, trophy countdown, please. Good news, Clutch. You can see that trophy in 60 seconds. Counting down. 60, 59, 58, 57, 56. <laughs> Trophy. Now, first we need to figure out what happened. Any ideas, Clutch? Uh, yes, I do have an idea how the trophy got wrecked. It probably went something like this. I'll bet the cleaner dogs drove the garbage truck to Ben Chibi's to empty the garbage bin. And it was the vibration from the garbage truck that caused the trophy to fall out. Then, as they were emptying garbage bins, some bag had glue that was stuck to an old roll of duct tape rolled out of the bin under the door and got all over the trophy. Yeah, yeah, that must have been what happened. Case closed. You're right. <sighs> Thanks to our excellent detective work, we have tracked down the culprits. Time to make an arrest. To the dump! Seatbelts on. You're under arrest. 
for the case of the broken trophy. The what? Don't try to deny it. I know you went to Rancini's last night, and the vibrations from your truck caused the trophy to fall out of the case and then get wrapped in the glue and duct tape which you dropped. Uh, sorry, but we were here last night stacking bumpers. We didn't drive by Rancini's. No, uh, really? Well then, uh, thanks for your help. Our pleasure. Too bad about the trophy. We heard it was so great that Strut couldn't let go of it. Ah, interesting. I hadn't heard that. Okay, we've come to a dead end. So, any other ideas, Clutch? Uh, maybe it was, uh, uh, uh... Would you like a ham sandwich? It might help you think. Ham? That's it, ham! A hamster broke the trophy. <laughs> oh, uh, you're serious? Yeah, maybe a hamster snuck into the clubhouse. Yeah, picture this. Hamsters like to chew on wood, and the trophy case is made of wood. So, maybe a hamster chewed on the trophy case's leg, and that's how the trophy fell out. The hamster tried to fix it with the glue because it felt really badly about breaking it. It could happen. Hmm. My super clever partner and I will now track down our new culprit and close the book on the case of the broken trophy. Wait, who exactly is the culprit? Why, Mag's pet hamster Lulu. Let's go find Mag's at the clubhouse. <laughs> See this? <laughs> innocent with me i know all about it lulu snuck into rancini's last night and ate through one of the legs of the trophy case and then when the trophy fell and broke she tried to fix it and pretend that nothing was wrong admit it lulu <laughs> there's no way lulu could have done that she's too small to eat through a leg of the case and besides she was here in her cage all night i see well then i must have the wrong suspect. Ha, that Lulu sure likes her broccoli. Oh, yeah. She reminds me of Strat holding on to that trophy yesterday. He sure didn't want to let go of it. Yeah, I'd heard that about Strut. Thanks, Max. <laughs> That's it. I know who broke the trophy. Go, me. <laughs> no, not you. It was Strut. He just couldn't let go of the trophy. No, not Strut. After brilliant detective work, my partner and I are ready to track down and arrest Strut and close the case of the broken trophy. But uh, first, we need to pick up some new batteries. Yeah. <laughs> Just like me. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Oh, I didn't see you. How's it going? Any luck with the case? You bet. You're under arrest. What? It wasn't me. I'm sure Strut didn't break the trophy. I know. It was a, a pack of gorillas. Or wild turkeys. Yeah. Uh... It's all over, Strut. Case closed. You're coming downtown with me. But I didn't do it. I didn't do it. No, it wasn't Strut. It was me. I broke the trophy. I'm sorry. I went to Rancini's to hold it and I dropped it. It was an accident. Clutch, how could you? Yeah, you broke the trophy. You didn't tell anyone it was you. And worst of all, you almost got strut into really big trouble. And you wasted all my time with all those crazy stories of yours. 
Why didn't you just tell the truth? I wanted to, but I felt so bad and scared. I knew I wasn't supposed to touch it. If I had been honest, then Strut wouldn't have been blamed for my mistake. I'm really sorry. Well, at least you're being honest now. But Clutch, you should never have tried to hide your mistake. That's the same as lying. So, you know what comes next. I'm under arrest. I'll go quietly. Strut? I'm sorry for blaming you. Do you really need to arrest Clutch? Well, no. Making a mistake isn't really against the law. But Clutch should make up for his mistake and buy a new trophy. Of course, I'd be happy to. Well, haha, <laughs> that finally solves the case of the broken trophy. Uh, wait, that's not the right music. The case of the broken trophy. Oh, uh, hold on a second. Uh, the case of the... Oh, rats, this isn't working out at all.